Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Cookie Craft. I think I just concussed my head on the door. I've been getting so many comments from you guys that Alec, aka the Cyrude, has been up to absolutely no good, and I think I see what he did. If you guys are not subscribed to Cyrude, then you guys probably did not see his latest video where I believe he stole my Aether Dragon, Skyrider. And I think that I have to put the dragon in here. I'm not sure Jack deserves this degree of revenge, but he needed to get something. Skyrider is definitely a lot smaller than he just was. Guys, I think it actually worked. Oh, yes. So we have three entirely fully grown dragons. Now, I don't know if it worked, but if it did, I think my dragon Skyrider should be down here. No way. I didn't want to believe it. There is no way. Skyrider is actually here. Nope, 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 nope. I'm taking Skyrider out of here. Why did he have to put dirt on Skyrider? This dude is a pleb. Yeah, take that, Alec. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen, I actually saw his video and I have been plotting my revenge for days. I will not just be breaking all of the blocks inside of his house. I will not just be destroying his machine. I am going to be taking the one thing he loves, uh, his dragons. Now, the only issue I ran into at first was that if I go over to his dragons and try to steal them, it says that the dragons have actually been locked by the owner. Now, I'm actually unable to use the dragon amulet on his dragons because once again, they're locked. So I really can't do anything other than kill them. Now, I don't know if I really want to do this, but my system today should allow me to not only steal his dragons, but also make them my own. Now, if this works, I will officially be the chief of dragons and almost have every single dragon type available on the server. In order to do this, though, I'm going to have to kill them to absorb their essence. Well, that is only step one today, so be sure to stick until the end of the video to see if I can do it. That is definitely karma saying I should not be doing this. No! Oh, it's working, it's working. Oh, I'm, I'm hitting it. Oh, I'm really sorry. I feel terrible. Oh, this is weird. This feels unnatural. I'm sorry, dragon. I, I, uh, they're not fighting back. I feel bad. Oh my gosh, dude. It's gonna be worth it, though, ladies and gentlemen. Die. Just, just make it quick. Just, just please go, go faster. How much health do you have? How much resistance? I don't want to do it from so close. I'm gonna stand far away and see. Will this work? Every time I shoot it with an arrow, the arrow just bounces off. Now, it looks like it actually does work. If I shoot the arrow down, it rains down a volley of arrows from my super powerful bow and eventually the dragon will explode. I think we did it, ladies and gentlemen. I feel terrible about myself. This is Alec's fault, though. Do not roast me in the comments. Roast Alec. He made me do this. Now, as you guys can see, I did manage to collect some dragon scales, but in this super dragon chest, you will notice we have dragon essence. Now, if Alec were to right-click down with this essence, it would actually spawn his dragon back in, which which is why today I am going to be creating a machine to reset this dragon and turn it into my own baby ender dragon. Oh no, this one will be the enchanted dragon. This will be the ender dragon. I'm really sorry. I gotta do this. No, 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 no. I almost shot myself again. This is Alec's fault. Alec decided he wanted to steal my dragons and make you his own big dragons. Not cool, bro. Make it quick. Just please. I, I don't like this at all. This is terrible. But once it's done, it'll be so worth it. These dragons will be my dragons. At least I hope so. If this doesn't work today, Alec is going to be so angry with me. I mean, honestly, he's still going to be extremely angry with me. Whatever you guys do, do not tell him about this. Is it working? Oh, yep. There we go. The Ender Dragon has gone down and we should be able to once again collect the Dragon Essence. And also the scales. I think I could use these too. Now, the next step in the process involves an incubator. In order to craft this, I'm going to need to probably head back to the Aether Dimension in order to grab some weird Holy Stone and ambrosium chunks, and also different planks. Now, if you're wondering why I need an incubator, I will explain as soon as we get there. By the way, if you guys did miss out on the episode where we found that ginormous stairway to heaven, definitely go check it out. There'll be a link down below in the description. Hello, Edison. How you doing? I'm not up to anything suspicious. Stop looking at me. Stop blanking. That's not natural in Minecraft. Okay, we need to be quick here. So we have the Holy Stone, we have the chunks, and we have the planks. If Alec logs onto the server right now, I think he might freak out. Okay, it looks like we should be able to collect some Holy Stone over here. No, do not stop. Why would I place it down? 
There we go. Holy stone. I think I only need a few. Just like that, I have my hands on nine. Next up, we need some ambrosium chunks. I believe these should spawn down deep underground in the heaven aether dimension. Aha, there we go. Is this ambrosium? Let's see. Ambrosium shards. I'm not entirely sure how many of these I need. Let's see. I got my hands on six, which I can use four together to combine them into chunks, which is what we need. Now, the last piece of the puzzle is actually the most important part. I need to get my hands on moa egg. Now, I believe I already have a few that we collected during the episode we spent in this dimension, but just in case I need some more, I'm just gonna have to, to steal this from you. Really sorry about that. I need at least three different colored eggs in order to combine them together to make a rainbow moa egg. Now, I don't know if this will work, but the idea is actually pretty simple. Once I craft the incubator, I'm going to combine the eggs together inside of the incubator, and then I should be able to use the dragon essence, combine that with the rainbow moa egg and hopefully turn that into a dragon egg. Let's see, we have a yellow moa, we have a pink moa. I need uh, I need one more moa. Is there any moa want to give me their egg? Hello, green moa. Oh, yeah, gonna have to uh, uh, take your egg. Really sorry about this. Don't look at me like that. Stop giving me the death stare. Okay, oh, I didn't mean to hit you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm getting out of your hair. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I think we should have everything that we need. Actually, wait, I think we... May need some logs. Come here, loggy log. There we go. Give me the logs. Boop, boop, boop. That should be good. All we need to do now is go head back over to the overworld. Edison, do not look at me like that, bro. Hopefully, I grabbed everything that we need. And also, hopefully, Alec isn't back yet, because if he is, this is going to be extremely awkward. Let's just go have a little tiny peek over here. Hey, how's everybody doing? I don't see Alec anywhere. Hey, Cooper, whatever you do, do not tell anybody I was ever here. Okay, let's go ahead back up to the top of my beautiful cookie tree. Let's see if we have all the different materials in order to craft the incubator. So I think it was planks on the bottom. We also need to first make a chunk of ambrosium. Planks on the bottom, and then we should just surround it with holy stone. And just like that, we have the incubator. Now let's go place this right out here this thing is sweet so now i need to grab my three separate moa eggs um we have a yellow one a green one and a green one how did i get two green ones i honestly have no idea but we only need the purple or the pink one or i how do i have two of them too do they multiply i honestly do not care that means more moas for me which we can actually use in a future episode to get moa pets be sure to subscribe so you guys do not miss out on that but in the meantime i should be able to gather all of the moa eggs together we have the yellow we have the purple pink yep it's called pink Pews? Is pews even a color? I don't know, but let's toss them all inside of the incubator to create the rainbow moa egg. Beep, beep, bop. Let's see, is it gonna work? Oh, they all dropped in. Perfect. Oh, oh my gosh. What are they doing? They're like jumping around. Now we just gotta do a little dance. Actually, I don't, I don't think you have to dance. I just, I, I, I had a wedgie. Wait a second. Did you guys see that? Hold up. If we move just a little bit closer, I only see one egg and it's the rainbow moa egg. No, I think I could actually use this to spawn in a moa, but no, I think that I can actually use the rainbow moa egg to spawn in a moa pet, which maybe I'll do in a separate episode. But for today, we need to use this thing inside of the incubator. Now, in order to power this thing, I actually think I need to put more chunks in the bottom. And I don't know if I have enough for more chunks. Come here, Chunky. Do we, do we have any more Chunky chunks? I need to put the Chunky chunk in the incubator. Any chunks up here? Do we have... Okay, we have more shards, which we can turn into Chunky chunks. Chunk, chunk. Perfect! Let's go put the Chunky chunks over here. Just like that. We'll put one inside. And I just realized, wait, I only have one Rainbow Moa egg. Okay, I need to act quick. When this gets to the top, it will hatch a Moa, but I'm thinking if I combine the Moa Essence with the Dragon Essence, it'll work. Let's see. I really want to do the Enchanted Dragon first. We'll just plop it inside. It dropped down. I think it'll work. Please, 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 dude. If this actually turns into a Dragon Egg or a Baby Dragon or a full-size Dragon that I can control, that would be legendary. Yo! No way! No way! Do you guys see that? Oh my gosh. I think it worked. Yes, okay. So there's no more rainbow moa egg. It combined with the dragon essence. And I think this is an enchanted dragon egg. Now, in order to be certain that this is not Alex dragon, I need to see... Okay, so I can't put it in my amulet, but when it hatches, I should be able to use raw fish and hopefully tame it. Now, the only problem is if it says that this is still locked to the owner, then my plan was a complete failure. 
but if it hatches and I'm able to tame it, that will mean that I have stolen one of his dragons, which nobody thought was possible. Dudes, dudes, it hatched. All right, can I use the amulet? No, 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 wait, I can tame the dragon. I can tame it. Is it mine? I did it, let's go. Revenge is so sweet. It tastes sweeter than cookies. Now, ladies and gentlemen, all I need to do is make one more rainbow moa egg and I can do the same thing with the ender dragon. From the episode when we were in the aether dimension, I did manage to get a couple other moas. So this one, I believe is, it says yellow. So we have, uh, I already have a yellow one. I guess I already have a green one. I need to use my Tempest one? This one is the coolest one too. Oh no, wait a second. I have another pink one. Haha, <laughs> don't have to use this one anymore. I have one more chunk left. So I should be able to combine all three eggs again in the incubator. One, two, three. Come on. Yes, they all dropped in again. And just like that, the same thing happened. And boom, we have a rainbow egg. We only have one more chunk left. So I need to make sure to do this right. Put the chunk in the bottom. We put the rainbow egg at the top and I need to cool quickly add the ender dragon essence boom there we go dropped it in it fell right in let's see if it works yes 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 dudes look at it we have an ender dragon egg Eat that egg. Can shoes even go rotten? I don't I don't care, okay? This was beautiful. And there we go. It just hatched too. Okay. Actually, I don't have an amulet for this guy. Um, all right. I'm going to I'm going to tame you. Can can I make you I'm going to make you sit. But there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. We not only today recovered Skyrider, my Aether Dragon. We also got revenge, stole Alex dragons, and not only did we capture them, we made them my dragons. He's going to be so angry. Ladies and gentlemen, there might be a war brewing on Cookie Craft. Be sure to subscribe if you have not already. You guys do not want to miss out on the future episodes to come. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. I now need name suggestions for my brand new Ender Dragon and my brand new Enchanted Dragon. Go ahead and leave a comment down below for both of those guys that is going to wrap it up i hope you guys enjoyed my name is beck bro savage and i will hopefully see you guys all back again here very soon unless alec kills me we'll see what happens peace out dudes Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys did enjoy that video, you have to subscribe right now with your forehead. Just headbutt the subscribe button and hit the like button with your toe. Thanks.